welcome to Spotlink Cast with Sean Bradshaw as Spot and Tom Kerwin as Link. Welcome to episode six of Spotlink Cast. Uh, I am Lig. Hello, Spot. You can follow us on Twitter at Spotlink Cast. You can find us on Facebook, facebook.com slash Spotlink. And you can subscribe to us on iTunes, Podomatic, and Stitcher, and probably loads of other places that as we well. Quite that we but we, we will. That, that we, we will. probably don't even know about unless people subscribe to us and we're like, what? Where'd this guy come from? We'll so, <laughs> we have been having uh, some interesting conversations. Yes, we have. Um, Currently on the topic of social media and its pros and cons. So, are you are you a social media user? I am indeed. I am indeed. What social media do you use? Mainly Facebook. Yeah. I dabble in a bit of Twitter. <laughs> dabble, yeah. Just a bit of a debate. Like, a, you're a Twitter wizard. No, 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 no. I haven't Dabbling. Quali- I haven't quite qualified that far yet. In the dark arts of Twitter. Oh, I wish. <laughs> <laughs> so, okay, so Facebook and Twitter. Yeah. Anything else? Not really. You say not really, right, but even things like YouTube have become social media. Yes, it has actually, but I don't want really to use it as a social media. No, you don't send messages to your friends through YouTube. You can, but it's kind of useless. You can have YouTube friends, which is like <laughs> completely <laughs> useless, but who's okay. friends on YouTube? <laughs> <laughs> I've got friend requests on YouTube you know from me- people I don't know, and it's like, who are you? Can you imagine meeting me- someone this? in a bar and be like, oh man, yeah, okay, what's your name, yeah? Are you on YouTube? <laughs> <laughs> I'll add you oh, on YouTube, yeah? So yeah, oh yeah, that's great. You now Facebook and stuff, blah 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 blah. Happy, happy, happy. Put a status, put a sad status, yeah. put a happy status. I'm feeling satisfied, content, relieved, something like that. Touched, um, yeah, by an angel. <laughs> feeling touched by an angel. <laughs> uh, and obviously, Twitter uh, as well. It's got its pros because you follow all the celebs. Yes, yeah, so you can get to the celebs. It's the di- pretty much a direct route to any celebrity you like. But. <laughs> But naughty, naughty Facebook. Naughty, naughty Facebook. Need they make slap. no. They do need a slap because they make no qualms on the fact that they use you for advertising purposes. Yes, they the, look. At, they, they read your guidelines sta- and stuff like they that. They read your statuses. Yeah. They look at your photos and cater their adverts to you, depending on what you write and what you post. Well, yeah, I'll be like, but it's like, it's on like uh, this laptop, and I'll be like, laptops half price on the side. Yeah, and I'm exactly. Like, hmm. Do I? It is. Facebook is very big brothery. You've got to admit. Yeah. It is. With the eye of Sauron. In. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that'd be amazing. That's We're going to make... We, we need to... This should be a Rose of the Rings parody. Just Facebook. Yes, yeah, the Facebook. There is no life <laughs> in the book. Only selfies. <laughs> <laughs> Basefuck. That's what the film's going to be called. Basefuck. <laughs> Um, although, 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 you, I'll be scrolling through the internet and it'll come up like fuckbook.com, Facebook of sex, and like, what are you searching for? It doesn't matter. I'm ty- typing in cabbage on Google Images. <laughs> Why don't know? Why are you cabbaging Google? That's beside the <laughs> point. Yeah. Google. For the. <laughs> Why am I cabbaging <laughs> Google's? <laughs> I love cabbage and Google. <laughs> it's a past time of mine. For the farm, I'm starting. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> My crops. Um, <sighs> so, say so I type in cabbage or anything, it could be like mm. chicken broth, anything. Doesn't Why matter. are you so bitch? I'm just searching for food all the time. Oh, you. Um, <laughs> so, I could be searching cabbage and on the side, it'd be like fuckbook.com. All these local girls now. Come on. Fuck off. There's no one on there. It's just men looking at pictures of fake women well, while they talk to other men. To be honest, all these local girls. Uh, yeah, local girls. Sharon wants to talk. Sharon wants to talk now. Click here to reply. And it comes up. Ding, doom. Viruses, malware, Trojan horse. You're fucked. <laughs> yeah, basically. But not in the way you were hoping for. No. It comes up like Sharon wants to talk. And it comes up. Like, as if it's, like, the old MSN from, like, 2001. Yeah. And it's like, Sharon's like, hello? Hello? Are you there? Anyone there? I'm naked and alone. My husband is away on business. Please come. And you're like... Nah. <laughs> no. 1.7 miles from your location. Oh, so, you really? One, how do you know my location? Yes, one, uh, yes, how do you know my location? And two, why is Sharon also 1.7 miles from 
my friend in America. <laughs> and do you honestly believe if there was some Randy Sharon who is only 1.7 miles away from me, you would honestly think I wouldn't know who she was? <laughs> <laughs> Sharon, who lives next door. <laughs> it's like, shit, that is actually Sharon from next door. Once oh, that would be horrible. <laughs> yeah, actually, the one I showed up, but you actually saw the picture of your next door neighbour. Uh, oh, it depends. Uh, well, if he's good looking. Oh, oh, he went there. Yes. Um, getting off the straight bandwagon. Um, but, <laughs> yeah, and it's like, it's yeah, things like that when you're like, oh, for fuck. Yeah. The internet is filth. Yes, the internet is filth. But the thing that gets the me, brave. the thing that gets me about Facebook that no one really gets, mm. right, that people think it's a service for you. It's not. It's really not. You're the product. <laughs> yeah. Because yeah. If, you, if you go on a website... You go on Facebook, it's got all this stuff, and it's completely free. Unless you're a Candy Crush slave. <laughs> Fuck off with the slave. Stop inviting Stop me. Stop inviting me to play okay. Candy Crush. I'm never going to play it. No. Stop it. Candy, I'm not playing Candy Crush Saga. Right. Fucking Genesis. Candy Crush Trilogy. Candy Crush fucking... Any the legendary journeys, candy fucking don't crush. I'm not just, playing anything. Just stop candy with the related. game invites. Just stop with the game invites. We're never gonna play them. Oh. Right. Okay, oh. rant over. Okay, <laughs> for now. For now, right? With Facebook, you're using this service for free. Yeah. All right. When they advertise it, they show profile pictures of people and stuff like that yeah you're the product you're being you're the thing that's getting toted out to say look look how good facebook is hey man that's that's pretty that's, my my confidence just went right up yeah. <laughs> like, look how good facebook is look who we got on here look who we got on here we got league you just nothing <laughs> <laughs> i know that i know that um that they changed all of their, their recent sort of um, terms and conditions stuff like that. So I the haven't fact read that, them yet. Okay, I haven't read. That. I haven't read them all the way through. As if anyone as if ever bothers, read, really. But they're always like, "Do you agree?" Pages. And I'm like, "Yeah, yeah, 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 I agree." And they're like, "Can we come and touch your bone?" Like, "Yeah, yeah, 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 yeah I we, accept, I accept, we, continue." No, we're agreeing to let them walk in with an elephant to cock slappers. Well, but, well, there was um, there was something oh, on a website. I can't remember what it was, or possibly in a store where the terms and conditions you agree to it. And like halfway down the list somewhere, it said you agree to sell us your, you, you agree to give your soul away f- to us for free, and it was done as a test to see if anyone reads them. And s- no, no one, no one got onto it at all. Everyone just accepted. Yeah, because no so one someone, reads terms and conditions. Someone That's somewhere why. owns pretty much everyone's souls, and I'm pretty sure I signed up for that as well. <laughs> Whatever. Yeah, it was. Well, your soul is fucked. <laughs> um, so if the devil offers me an agreement, I'll be like, I'm so, look, man, I've given yeah, my I'm soul away to actually uh, obligated to Saga.com. <laughs> Well, he's the devil. He can probably get you out of it. <laughs> yeah, true. That. He's like, oh, good, me too. <laughs> how do you think devil. I? Ended up, how do you think I ended up here? Satan sent you an invite to play Candy Crush Saga. <laughs> Fuck off! <laughs> and it's the one that you could, there's no decline button. Like, no. Just ignore it then. Yeah, but they changed it, like the terms and conditions to say like basically any photo you upload, any anything you upload, basically even the status and stuff, they are ours. Yeah, yeah. ours. Yeah. Yeah. And they're like, so if you put a picture of your mom on Facebook, it's like, we own your mother. We own, no, they don't own your mother. They own just a picture of your we mother. We own a picture of your mother. Even though you can just copy it out and save it again, so it's yours again. But it's surely the original file on my computer. It is mine. Yeah, but so, you've, you've copied that photo into Facebook. So they so own a copy of a photo? They yeah. don't even own the photo? No, they own a copy of a copy of a copy of a photo of someone. How many times did you copy that photo before you put it on Facebook? Depends how many times I put it on social media. Ooh. Oh, true. Um, but I don't. I, I don't even. Know, I don't know much about the Twitter guidelines. I mean, are they just as racy? Twi- or I don't are they, know. Are they yeah, just I've as... honestly never read them, and to be honest, no one really goes on about them. That's true. So it can't be. So it can't be that bad. Maybe not. But yeah, I mean. Oh, there's so many platforms for it now. On Facebook, Twitter, obviously the main probably. Two. Um, Do you remember MySpace when that was cool? Yes, I remember MySpace when that was cool for the whole two weeks it was there. With... And you could make your own backgrounds and everything. Yes, yeah, so you can make your own terrible quality backgrounds. You used to be able to make your own backgrounds on Facebook before they took that away. No way. Before they changed the timelines. They didn't. It. Before they forced onto the new timelines. They did. I I made one. Uh, then they then they forced onto this new timeline stuff. I don't remember making your own backgrounds on. Facebook. I did. Yeah, it was a pain in the ass to do, but I did it. Yeah. I did do I it. I found one online. 
Well, yeah, it, it, you, you do <laughs> templates and stuff to do. Like, you go to, like, Facebook backgrounds and do, like, a template or whatever. Facebook whatever. backgrounds? I really It was an app it. that was on Facebook for Facebook backgrounds and stuff. You can make your own background and stuff before they change it to timeline. Is this when MySpace was still cool? So they were like... This okay, was, this what, what are MySpace doing? This and then they did it and they thought, you know what, no, yeah. that, that sucks anyway. Yeah, this is when they were competing against each other. So. Okay. Well, MySpace is basically just music now. Well, it's basically just owned for, It's not much just... I don't know if it's still Justin Timberlake, but I know it's, it's not it's owned by, by Justin Timberlake. Um, and then he's basically turned it into um, a, a, a sort of music sharing. We share your music. and Yeah. I wonder if Tom's still there. Tom from MySpace Tom? Doubt MySpace it. Tom. Doubt it. Yeah, I remember my friend joined MySpace when like we were first... Everyone was sort of on it. Um, back in probably the end of 2000s. So. Yeah, and 2003, 2004. I remember he joined and signed up and he was like, hey, um, I've joined my space, yeah? I was like, yeah, yeah, okay. And he's like, and a, a guy added me straight away. It was really nice of him. His name was Tom. And he sent me a message just welcoming me. I was like, oh, yeah. Poor global um, I had enough the heart to tell him that it was the owner that and that it was a default him. generic message sent to everyone. Yeah, everyone. I, I say him. I didn't have the heart to tell him. I told him straight away. <laughs> I was like, yeah, you've still got no friends. Yes, you've still got no friends. Yeah, but he's still, one is still more than I have. <laughs> Play the violins. But yeah, but there's obviously, okay, Facebook, Twitter, MySpace, MySpace, sort of. MySpace isn't really social media. Instagram anymore. is social media, basically, because it's, well, just, it's just, just photos. Photos, social media, well, videos as well. Well, oh, yeah. Do you know what I do not understand for the life of me? And I have got it, and I just, I, I don't know. I don't even, I don't. Tumblr? No. I d- I'll give you a clue. It's not really a clue. I don't do any outgoing messages or pictures, but I, I just sort of have a look at the incoming ones. They disappear pretty quickly. Oh, Snapchat. Snapchat. I just don't get it. If that's the point. It was because like, it disappears so quickly. It's just like a random thing. Like if you're sitting at home and you feel like pulling a funny face at your mate who's like out in town or something, you just use Snapchat. He, probably- he looks at it, he sees your funny face and it goes away. <laughs> but what if he wants it to come back oh but people take screenshots of them and stuff like that now and like what yeah there's leaked snapchat stuff damn i so careful with snapchat now I hope my, my snapchat nudes don't uh, get out when I'm a celebrity well, well it wasn't snapchat they got, it was it was like the apple cloud and stuff like that they got hacked with that stuff well apparently there's leaked snapchat thing as well yeah there's leaked but snapchat it's because people stuff, use, use like a screenshot thing and they just screenshot the fucking yeah, photograph but the majority of it was um, with the celebrities it was like their cloud got hacked from like the pictures on their phones. Oh yeah. So it wasn't just Snapchat, it was just their private pictures on their phones. Imagine people from the eighteen hundreds and someone saying, Look, his cloud got hacked, yeah. And it's like what? he owned what? a cloud. He walked up to him with a satchel <laughs> and scraped his cloud. <laughs> he scraped his rain device. <laughs> no, he used this device that you fit in your pocket that can literally do do anything you want, get all the information in the world that we use to look at funny cats. <laughs> He's <laughs> like, but all of the information in the world is a typical Victorian gentleman. And and what do you do with all this information? How do you how do you find it? And he's like, what 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 what, what would you search for? He's like, well, I just type in lol cats, cats doing funny things. Lol yeah. cats. What's lol? Laugh out loud. Why would you not laugh out loud? Laughing is a fun thing to do. Laugh out loud all you like. We do. A cats. But we we <laughs> just will send lol because we can't. We're not actually laughing. No. no one's laughing when they put lol, right? No, 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 really. No. It's like, what are you up to, lol? If it was real, what are you up to? <laughs> <laughs> it's like, um, I, I, it's not really a funny question. Uh, I'm just, I'm just, uh, I'm at a funeral, lol. That always gets me that. I mean, could you If you're imagine- laughing out loud at a funeral. <laughs> no. At a funeral, lol. <laughs> I've seen people do stuff like that. And taking the priest. Se- taking the- selfies with, like. <laughs> The yeah, priest like, just, the priest just stood there at the front like, and we remember Philip for all of us somewhere in the background. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, just sent me a text. He asked what I was doing. No, but I mean, I can, I have seen selfies of people taking like selfies of themselves with their deceased relatives and stuff like that, smiling over their dead bodies, going, oh, look, they look like they're asleep. That isn't a new thing. That that Victorian gentleman we were talking about will probably say, oh yes, we've done that as well. Because I saw it recently. Oh, he's caught, he probably got, got it carved or painted. It's just standing there for ages. The body had already decomposed by then. <laughs> we're just, we're done. <laughs> Look, he always wanted the portrait done. Just do it quickly before he decomposes. Um, that I saw I saw something on the uh, Interminets recently. Interminets. The Interminets, yeah? Yes. Um, and it was all like pictures of people. I think it's probably... 
They were all black and white photos, so they must have been maybe early 1900s or late I late 1800s, possibly, which I, I think, think I know what you're talking about. And it was just pictures, and it, there was a trend where pe- when a member of the family died, they would set them up as if they were still alive, open yeah. their eyes, position them in a little pose, and t- and have a family photo with them. Yeah, that was that's that's very strange. That's sick. But that, yeah, I mean, could you imagine saying that? Uh, it was, uh, it was in, trending in, on Twitter today to do that. People would do it. <laughs> Take a pic with dead rel day. Yeah. And um oh, what corpse funnies. <laughs> oh. Um oh. But yeah, and I was like, what? There's some really creepy ones, but there's like ones yeah. babies and stuff, man. It's really oh, horrible that's, stuff. That's, that's something. Yeah, but um It's quite horrifying that actually. The, isn't like, it? The practices that you do. But if you're saying people do that now. People do something similar stuff like that, they think pictures with like the dead man. Well, is stuff. it with people taking pictures of dead people? I don't know. It's, I don't know. People just like dead people, I think. <laughs> Thank God he's dead. Let's, we'll finally get that bloody picture he was always banging on well, about. He, well, he always blinked in the pictures and now he doesn't have to. <laughs> we can finally get a good picture of him. <laughs> just uh, just hold his eyelids open, yes. Oh, oh dark. <laughs> yeah, quite dark. But, I mean, talking about like going back in time and meeting like sort of oldie worldy people and stuff. Yeah. Stuff and try and explain oh, no. electricity to them. Like you're sitting there in front of like all the world pioneers, like Michelangelo, Galileo, and all that. The biggest minds of like the time. Or, or, or we could just take it back to to, to a little a little sixteen hundred, not sixteen hundred year old woman, a woman <laughs> from the sixteen hundreds. Just a just a little just a little housewife, and she's like, well, right, right, either way, but but it, either way, could you imagine trying to? Um, show them everyday objects and stuff like that, like microwaves and stuff to them. It would blow their minds. If they put their head in it. <laughs> <laughs> you show them like a computer. And you go, like, look, this is what we call a computer. They're right? like, no, let's start the basics. Can we just lift, can we go over switching the light on and off again, please? <laughs> let's not press that. <laughs> let's not do that. Right. You show them a computer and you go, right, this is a computer. It can access anything in the world. It can do loads of different things. So how does it work? You take, like, you take this lead Right, and you plug it into the wall. Plug? You take a plug. Right? What, what, what's a plug? It's this. It's a little plug. Three-pronged thing. You plug it into the wall. But we're in America. Okay. Okay, a two-pronged <laughs> fucking thing then. Right? You plug it into the wall. And then... Well, <laughs> That's the way they knew. That, yeah. that was different ones. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, okay, so what, what, do what do you do? What do you do? You plug it into the wall yeah. and something happens. Oh, something right? happened. And all pictures appear on this, this screen here. I slow down. <laughs> on the screen. I don't right? understand. And it changes and stuff, and you can do whatever you want with it, right? I need to sit down. Yes, go and sit down. And while you do it, I'll make you some toast in this toaster. Ooh, what does the toaster do? Does it why? cure world hunger? Are you talking to yourself? I, I'm asking the questions right. here. Well, ask me what a toaster does. What, what, what does a toaster do? Right, what you do is you get your bread down from your local bakery. Okay, right? I, I know that part. That's easy. Yes, you... S- you slice the bread. Yeah, I can do into that as well. Bread. You stick it in the slots in the toaster. In the what? In the toaster. What's a slot? There's openings in the toaster. Openings. Right. You put the bread in the opening. Okay. I'll just. Right? Okay. Then you get the lead. The, the but what? plug it into the wall. Same as a computer. Okay. Hang on. So you're going too fast for me. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, do you remember the little lead and the plug from the computer? Um, yeah, to make right. the pictures show up. The, the pictures, yes, I remember the right. pictures. So many bright lights. Work, toasters work in the same sort of way. They have a lead and a plug. You plug it into the wall, and then you pull a little lever, wait for five minutes, and your bread cooks. Can we carry on tomorrow, please? I don't feel very well. No, we're carrying on. <laughs> right. Then, if you want to keep stuff fresh, yes. you use what we call a fridge. A fridge. Yes. It keeps all your food nice and cold and fresh, and it lasts for longer. Why didn't they have these back in the fucking 1600s? It would have been so much fucking easier. I don't bloody know. You've got them now because I've brought them here. Right? Can I just have a quick look on the ends from my neck? And just, right. Please. And then it's the same thing as others. You get the lead and you plug it into the wall. And something happens. Stop See, it. I, look, I'll, just, I'll Google it tomorrow, okay? You're it, like, what? What? I'll Google, Google it. it. Yes, the, uh, Doctor Who came back and, and told me a few things. I'll Google <laughs> I, I, I need a rest. And you can also, instead of going to a hole in the floor, you can use this to go... It's called a toilet. Right? You go into it, you press a button, flushes all your waste away and goes away. Where does it go? 
It goes into the wall. There, <laughs> 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 this is wrong. The advanced wall. But the wall. Uh, I go, so we're. Uh, so I'm what? trying to understand this. So I'm plugging my picture toast into the wall with the poo lids. <laughs> Because I'm so hard to wrap my head around all this, dear. Pretty much. Pretty much how it works. Are you telling me I don't have to shout slops and throw my bucket into the street from above anymore? No. And cover all the cats in our shit? No, just all goes into the wall. It goes into the wall? But where does the wall go? I need to take a good look at these walls, dear. Uh, What? I I just don't understand. (laughs) Wow, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, that so, was fucking hard. That would, that would just destroy well, it. It's hard enough think. explaining how to switch the channel over from the uh, from the usual television to the PlayStation to my grandma. <laughs> no. Never. It's two buttons. Press, just press that button and then press that button. She's like, I'm just going to call you to do it next time. But yeah, okay. <laughs> just, just call me. <laughs> I don't know why she's playing on the PlayStation. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Google Plus. Google, right, right. Do you know anybody who's ever said to you, hey man, are you on Google Plus? Yeah, YouTube. When I was trying to sign up for that <laughs> fucking thing. <laughs> okay, anyone personally. So I could bloody a, a comment human, on a video. A human who's asked you if you're on Google Plus? No. Apart from me right now. Because everyone was getting forced to go onto bloody Google Plus so you could comment on a bloody video on YouTube. Stop. It's weird, yeah. If you if you make a YouTube account, you sort of automatically on. Google you get Plus. put on Google Plus because like, your Google account that you sign into Google with signs into your your YouTube as well. But it does, yeah. It's all linked with Gmail as well, stuff yeah. like that, you know. And yeah, man. But I don't get Google Plus. I've tried to. I, use I don't it. use I've tried it. To get me the only thing it. I use it for is commenting on on YouTube. I don't actually go onto like the Google Plus website or anything like that. Yeah, I mean, I used to I used to go on there a little bit, but like I've just. Just does, does, does nothing. There's nothing. There's nothing there. It's unattractive as well. It's just it's stupid. just white, and you're like you're forced into it, which is the worst thing you can do because then no one will want to use it. Then for like reverse psychology, yeah, up this. What is it? Google Plus, social media. Oh, okay. Can I use that? You have to. I don't want to know. Yeah, it's free. Well, that's tough it shit. Doesn't... You're making you're making me you're making me do it. So the Google Plus. Uh, there's a, uh, there's a, uh, where's where 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 is Jack and that that's a brilliant website so that one audible um, <laughs> but there's obviously there's things that I don't really know anything about which is like Tumblr and, and, and I've tried uh, Tumblr no, I can't get my head around it I tried Tumblr it's like a blogging kind of thing right it is a blog- I tried Tumblr I put, posted one blog and deleted my account I just, one because no one looked at it two <laughs> <laughs> because I just don't yeah don't supposedly know. to get people to look at your stuff on Tumblr because there's so many people you've got to put like about a million tags into it to get people to even look at it yeah you like just Candy so you Cross Saga it. hashtag just so you can find it I mean even if it's a blog about cats you've got to put like sexy strap on dildo porn just to like get some <laughs> sad person to look at is that head. how I got onto your cat blog <laughs> maybe <laughs> um that brings us to the end of episode six. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, and follow Spodlycast.